Hi, Emily. It's Carolyn. Uh, forgive my voice. I've had a cold all week long. Um, but I couldn't resist after seeing your November favorites. <laughs> um, I thought I'd do a quick um, November favorites myself. Um, just to show everyone I'm still in the land of the living, barely. Um, so, okay, so face care, I guess, skin care. Um, I've been using this oil-free Neutrogena uh, acne wash, um, and it's a salic salic acid acne treatment, and I really um, been liking this. Um, I guess through menopause, I get you know through here and here and under my chin, but this is really helping. And then I um, the toner I'm using is a Bean, and um, I've been using this for get eight months and um, I really find this combination is um, quite good um, and when I'm you know at night time if I'm tired or whatever um, I'm still using my oil of Olay or my Olay facial wipes these are great um, and I took um, I keep in the car a box of Huggies um, I just find they're handy to have um, and then uh, moisturizers and such. Uh, still using my uh, L'Oreal, uh, sorry, collagen filler wrinkle decrease. Um, loving this. And this is actually, now I've had this probably a good six months and I still haven't finished it. And I do have a backup for that. Uh, I then have, uh, I just purchased some new L'Oreal stuff. so. Um, I got the Lancome High Resolution Collar 5 times 5 I guess. Uh, so this goes on uh, before my moisturizer. Um, and then I just got the new Regenery. Regener I don't know how to pronounce it. I don't want to say it because it all sounds horrible. Uh, lift Volumetry. Uh, volumetric Lifting and Receiving Cream. And that's this. And it's um it's lovely it's lovely and rich and oh, it's just yummy I love Lancome products um, and then for my eyes I've been using Avon's Ultimate um, a new Ultimate and it's kind of cool packaging so this is what you wear during the day and you essentially put it under your eye and just under your brow and then at at night time you do the bottom part and then the top flips open and you then apply that here and here um, at night so that's kind of cool uh, then getting on to makeup so um, the Maybelline smooth dream mousse finally finally came to Canada and I got this at Pharmasave and I got this in porcelain ivory and I'm not too sure if this is the right color. Um, so, and I've only been using this about a week, and I'm still kind of playing with it. Um, I think it was Julia Gulia um, said she wasn't having much luck with it herself, and then she started using the Elf Kabo, I believe the El Kabo, or Elf similar to this. Anyway, this is the Sigma F80 that I got a couple months ago. So I've been trying with that, um, so I'll keep playing with it, and if I'm not successful, I'll go for the ALF. Um, and then, oh, sorry, so before I put on the, uh, obviously, um, I've got my matte prep and prime. Um, I, I have been, oh, actually, I just wanted to mention this. I stopped by the uh, Estee Lauder counter. I've been wanting to try the double wear makeup face makeup foundation anyway so I got a little sample of it and I really do like it but I'm going to have to keep testing it a little more to see if it's gonna work for me this is actually one in one accrue so we'll see how that goes um, okay so for eyes I've been I went out and got the um, Revlon age defying moisturizing concealer cream so far so good um, I specifically use it for under my eyes. I'm still, I stick to my um, MAC Studio Finish Concealer for my, um, around here, my nose, etc. Um, and um, my 
Colossal Volume Express Mascara. Loving that. Still loving my uh, L'Oreal Carbon Black Intense Liner. And I actually just picked up, I love purple. I don't know if anybody knows that. Um, anybody who knows me well knows that I love purple, purple, purple. So I just picked up the Alme Intense Eye Color Eyeliner Crayon. Actually, this is the wrong one. <laughs> this is this would actually be a regret, um, but I'll find the other one that I got. Um, still using my Lancome Taupe Brow Pencil. Loving that. Um, and then I just recently picked up, or actually I just ordered it, and I, I just got it last week. Um, and it's the Flawless Youth Forever, and I'm not sure... I saw this on someone's video. Anyway, um, this is a summer berry, and this is so pretty. It is so pretty. And I think I'm really kind of boring when it comes to my blush. I've sort of stuck to the same one, a Lancome, for ages and ages. But this is just freaking gorgeous. So it leaves, now what I like is it's got, I don't know, several different colors. Um, but I am especially liking just these two here and mixing them together. Oh, oh my, they're oh, orgasmic. It's just gorgeous. Um, I wish I could remember who, what, who, whose video I was watching for that, but oh, just love it. And I've still been using the uh, Mineral Glow Pearls Beige Pearl. Sorry. Um, powder. Um, and I use I use this really lightly, and then to finish off with my lips, I just picked up uh, this is a Revlon Super Lustrous Cream Lipstick uh, number four seven three Movi Night, and it's kind of cool because it's got a clear top, so you can see the color. And I don't know if I've got that far enough up. And there you go. And I have that on right now, but I don't know if you can tell because the lighting in here is really bad. Um, so yeah, so those are those are my favorites um, for the month of November. I actually have had a little bit of a haul, um, but I'll do that when my voice isn't so croaky. Anyway, um, really nice to see you, Emily. Um, take care, and we'll see you soon. Bye.